So let's pick through these scenarios now. We're going to go through a number of different scenarios. The first one is just translating. And I did have this fancy. I'm going to try clicking that dot, dot, dot. Let's, let's go for it. I haven't done that yet. Well, there it goes. And this brings us to the FME format page. And did you know you can just go here and click raster? And this shows you all of the raster formats that we do. Wow. And um, so folks at home can maybe check that out themselves. But suffice to say that there is quite a large number of different raster formats. And um, I'll probably leave it at that. And let's hop back to our presentation and take a look, actually, at a scenario that I've got from before. And if this is all right, is that here? Um, yeah, let's go like this. Is there one? Yeah, this is a, no, I won't say that. Here's what a, a translation that involves ra raster does, Dave. It's pretty simple. Very simple. I don't think I'll even bother running it. But really, you just uh, can have your input format. You connect it to an output format. And that's about all there is to it. So very easy to do translation between formats. Resampling is also very straightforward. And so let me go and grab my um, resampling example. Where is that? That's number two here. And to do that, we use this thing we call the raster resampler. And uh, you can, I guess, say, use it a couple ways to say the maximum size of an image you want. Yeah. How many rows and columns? Or you can take a cell size if you want a fixed pixel size. Or for some more foreshadowing, you can pick a percentage of your size. Oh, I don't even know where that's going to show up. And I guess we also have a few different um, <coughs> interpolation kernels you can pick as well when you're resampling. Yeah, the recommend, least recommended for imagery uh, would be the bicubic. It takes a little longer, but produces the best quality of output. So I just ran this one. Um, let's just uh, go ahead and inspect that output. All right. Whoops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to go find my GeoTIFF. There it is. It's a raster. That's the thing here. And if I click on it, I can see that. What will it tell me here? It's 400 by. Oh, that's not surprising because that's what it was set to. Yes, that's what so, we chose. So that's a good, good thing. So that's resampling. 